Hello, this is going to be a video about An American Marriage by Tiare Jones. Um, this came out in 2018 and it won the Women's Prize for Fiction in 2019. And it is about a relationship between two people, um, Roy and Celestial. Uh, Roy basically gets accused of raping an old woman. He's obviously innocent, but he gets sent to jail. Um, and for, for 12 years, he's sentenced to 12 years in jail for this rape. And um, it's about how they kind of navigate their relationship um, over the time he's in prison and really about like what's going to happen when you get out and spoiler, he gets out at a certain point in the book. Um, but Celestial also has this childhood friend called Andre um, who, I mean like from the very beginning you're like, I mean he's, def he's like definitely in love with her and like something's going to happen. Um, so yeah, I was reading this in work the other week um, and a co-worker came up to me and she was like, oh, I read that book, what did you, what do you think about it? And I was only about a third of the way through so I couldn't really articulate anything yet. And she grabbed it and pointed at the back to this Barack Obama quote, which says, a moving portrayal of the effects of a wrongful conviction on a young African American couple. And she said, I don't think Obama's read the book because it's not about the wrongful conviction, it's about their relationship as a couple. And I would entirely agree with that. And that's like one of the things that is really annoying about this. So I, I read this for um, my book club that we had last night. That's why I waited to film this video. Um, and we all really felt quite similarly that um, it's too easy to read. Like it, it read like an airport fiction. Um, and it's so like topical to be talking about wrongful convictions of black people in America. And that's a shame because it doesn't do justice to the actual topic of the book, which is these two people navigating their marriage. And I've been surprised that I feel like every review for this says it's kind of flawless and love it, but I'm a very cynical person and I'm especially skeptical of when books are really popular and are about very like prescient topics because it does kind of feel like someone was like ah oh, if i wrote a book about a wronged african-american man you know people are going to get behind that because they feel like they're supposed to be behind it anyway regardless of the content of the book i have mixed feelings about the content of the book there are some elements that i thought were fantastic it being about this marriage and him going to prison and them navigating like their duties to one another like if he's been wronged um like why should she why should he lose her as well as losing like his his livelihood and his his life and his respect um why should like isn't she supposed to be there for him in sickness and in health no matter what like shouldn't she be faithful to him and wait for him but it's also like you've been wronged but you shouldn't drag me down with you. And uh, I think that's a, a really interesting um, topic and, and very nuanced and delicate. And I think that elements of that were portrayed really well in here. Um, but because it's kind of an airport flick, um, it sort of like crescendos to this love triangle, um, which I found quite unsatisfying. And the way I think it plays out very dramatically um, which makes for like good fast reading, but not very realistically. And I felt that while I was reading it, it didn't seem like sincere in its conclusion, um, which was a shame because I, I feel like that kind of brought the novel down. Also, one other thing, I just like didn't like any of the characters and not in a you're interesting to not like way, but I just couldn't really sympathize with them. I feel like it didn't, it's because it's quite short and, and, and sharp. You don't, really get to know enough of the characters to sympathize with them and it starts being very like the first 20 pages things are happening really quickly and i was like oh yeah this is going to be rip roaring and then it really slows down and kind of goes back in time to like give a little bit more context uh which i found kind of sad because if you're gonna promise me a fast-paced interesting book you then can't then give me that and then try and backfill it to to add like meaning to these events. Um, so yeah, I had quite mixed feelings about this book. I did find it interesting, but as I say, the whole like wrongful conviction thing isn't the thing that should be interesting about this book. Yes, that is my thesis. 
Have you read it? Did you enjoy it? Um, do you agree with any of the points I've made? Let me know down in the comments. So I hope you've enjoyed this video on An American Marriage by Tayari Jones. Uh, I will see you in the next one. Bye.